Hey there guys, it's Sugai Senpai. So tonight, uh, I just wanted to share a haul video. So I went to Las Vegas' Sabacon and 2016. Eh, haven't been back in two years, but it blew my mind. And here's some few things I want to share. So, oh, and if you didn't know, mm, oldies, you know, can't, I can't live without the good old Naruto. Old kids gotta stick to it. <laughs> so, yeah, I got a few stickers here. My junior and a Goldine. This buddy, forgot his name, drawn a blank, <laughs> and a Abro. If anyone out there is uh, really interested in going to their first con, please guys, go with friends, because going with friends rather than your parents, it, there's, it's just worlds apart. You don't have to hold in your excitement. Especially running towards other cosplayers where it's like, oh my gosh, dude, look at that. Well, rather than going with your parents like, mom, uh, could you take my picture with that really hot looking cosplay guy? Thanks, yo, thanks. <laughs> Cause um, you Fujoshi's out there, <laughs> yo, you know what's up. The free cosplays are my, uh, my favorite, <laughs> yo. Um, so here we go. Keep going, pushing forward, and we got Kantai Kore, or you know, the really adorable boat girls. <laughs> um, I actually really just enjoy their uniforms, honestly. I just love that feel for the I don't know, it's like boat meets girl and and or object meets a, having like a real personality I feel that it's something one of my kicks it's like oh I am definitely getting into it <laughs> and um, I mean the whole experience at SabaCon with my friends um, I just wanted to give out a shout out to Khan Jennifer and Khan's baby sister Mercedes, um, thank you guys so much because going to the con with you guys just, it blew my mind. Like I was really happy we got to go and from the time that we started going and to the day, the time that we had to leave, like it was really great. And shout out to all those cosplayers that I had seen, goodness, everyone was so great and so friendly. Thank you guys so much. And um, one thing I wanted to let you guys know is um, <laughs> when you go to a con, you don't have to, let's see, I'm not too sure, like you don't have to be afraid. You can be yourself. You can be who you want to be. Literally, people were like, oh, hmm, they were, their, they were themselves and I could feel that the anime community, the cosplay community, everyone is so, so true to themselves. Um, thanks for that, because it it just made the experience uh, really worthwhile, and it just felt so good. <laughs> Literally, I I suppose the whole day I was running on adrenaline and memories that <laughs> I'll be coming back to on and on and I wish that everyone could get to enjoy the convention life so even if it's your like what annual or local um, co convention or if you don't even want to cosplay that's all good um, just just experience it once and maybe you might get hit hicked what <laughs> maybe you might get hooked so just saying Y'all might like it. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> but yo, Sabacon 2016. It was lit. It was lit, guys. It was lit. 
Oh right. Um let's see, what what else did I get? Oh, oh. I got this um adorable uh, uh Vocaloid um what is this? Okay, it was like a jack thing for your phone and I thought it was so cute. And I ended up getting the little baby sister let's see, right here. I ended up getting her and she sits on top of my phone. All cute like. Oh focus. You can do it. Or no. Nah. Let's see. Maybe it's a bit too bright. Here we go. And when I go to the gym and work out, y'all, plug her up onto the phone or er, headphone, headset thing. And she just stares at me when I when I'm just out of breath and I'm just like that's what I'm gonna do when I get home I'm a knockout <laughs> so she is right there <laughs> so adorable um I guess one thing I'd like to say as well is um from my friend Khan um you know that the the figurine is legit when they pay attention to details so, if you guys know what I mean, mm, it is, you're you going to pay good money, is what I'm trying to say. So, uh, look for those details, the details that we don't really think about. So, when you're, when you're getting your figurines, make sure you check for those details, okay? Details. <laughs> oh, God. And, um... For my Fujoshi friends out there, um, BL, BL Madness at cons, yo. Um, I didn't get to find a Yaoi paddle. It's been one of my things to own for quite some time, but I live with my fam. Yeah, having Yaoi paddle, uh, not, not yet. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> so, let's keep going. Um, Let's see. I found these really cute pins and shout out to you, Jennifer. Thank you so much. Oh, they were let's see, ooh, fabric pins. And this came in a set and it's just all electric type Pokemon. <laughs> let's see. Not too shiny. Oops, here we go. There we go. The Pokey Pin Pack. And I'll put a link in the description for uh, the products, the people that I've bought from. I'm pretty sure I have all their cards, so try to give them some credit too. Because they, the people, the vendors are really sweet people. They talk to you. They're not all about the money. They really give you background about, <clears throat> excuse me, their information, like, the background on their product and it really gives you that connection of like yo buy from me because A, B, and C and if you get hooked onto their A, B, and C just know you'll leave the con with really heavy arms of goodies <laughs> so yes people will talk you sweetness talk you into getting your goodies and if y'all couldn't hear that, you gotta put, you know, listen. Listen harder. <laughs> and the second to last thing that got my, uh, monies is, uh, <laughs> this, uh, How to Draw Manga book. <laughs> um, I could just say one thing, uh, I can't draw. Try to draw for, uh, like, what try to self self teach myself no I couldn't do it so maybe hopefully this book will uh, help me out and um, maybe improve my myself I don't even know if I'll ever show my drawings but if y'all haven't seen sexy uh, I can give a demonstration and sexy is um, sexy the cat and I usually uh, just draw him on my notes and um yeah 
here is Sexy's first debut. So tell me guys, um, who who out there has uh, ever done cosplay before? Cause uh, I don't really cosplay much, but this jacket here, guys, if you guys are wondering, uh, this is way back when freaking what Naruto was super hype up in middle school and. Yo, I'm a college student, guys. I'm a college student. So, this is way old. Way old. And the the fabric of it, like, I just take care of it really well. Like, I've washed it, and I, I rarely wear it, but it was just a, something I wanted to do for this video. But, I don't know. Like, it's just crazy when I think about it, like... People make, hand make their costumes and sew up stuff that, like, I just, it's so, like, mind-blowing. Especially, um, when I, when we had gone to the con and there were people walking in Effie, like, Fire Emblem Fates, like, oh, I lost it. I was just starstruck. Um, shout out to those guys because they're really awesome people, man, um. Let me see. Let's let's give them the throw out, like give them that shout out that they most highly deserve, bro. Let's see. Um, they're really um, oh my gosh, <laughs> they're really sweet people. They they're just all in character and all encompassing everything down to the last like swirl of the armor, like. It was, it, oh my god, <laughs> it was amazing. So, I'd like to shout out to um, Korean Barbecue, Kintastic, Lethal Soul, uh, and Mariah Malad. Thank you guys so much. Um, you guys really made the con amazing for my whole experience of Subacon. For that, just blew my mind. Oh, and, um,. I just wanted to know if you guys out there like just playing the games and getting your merch but have you guys ever considered doing cosplay? Like have any of you guys ever been uh maybe I shouldn't cosplay because I don't like have you ever had those like like those ideas of like oh I won't look in good in this cosplay like I mean it's like Halloween but like for everybody like everyone does Halloween too right right I don't know I I I still throw this out for Halloween too like I I put it on throw on the <laughs> the little lines and whatnot but I don't know like do people feel the same way like when it comes to Halloween like is cosplay equal to Halloween or something for everyone or is that just my interpretation of it so those were the people that the cosplayers that I had met at Subacon and thank you guys so much Fire Emblem fan super dedication for those for the just everything like oh my gosh <laughs> thank you and actually wait did I say that this book was uh second to last I I apologize uh there's two more things I have a oh. oh I got a RE0 Bay right here. Let's see. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Sorry about it. Yo my bay right here. Oh my gosh. So I would really like to thank the artist. Uh, she was really sweet as well. Everyone was so sweet. Thank you so much. And um, most definitely, when you guys come back, I will purchase more from you. <laughs> I love the artwork. You are so inspiring. And last but not least, a Sabacon t-shirt. I mean, yo. Here we go. If we can't get that close up. Here we go. And um, I apologize throughout the video if uh, you hear a noise, it's it's my fan. <laughs> Yo, 
it's hot. It's hot still. Vegas life. It sucks. It's hot right now, guys, in Vegas. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so, let's see. Had my shirt. <laughs> um, wait for it. Wait for it. All right. So, the print that I had purchased from the con is her. Oh my gosh. Janet Chan. Oh no, here we go. Oh, here we go. Yep, Janet Chan. So sweet, so kind. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. <laughs> and, wow. <laughs> People, people at the con, thank you. Thank you guys so much. The experience was mind blowing. I went to my first panel with my friends, but it was, um, yo, go to the panel with knowledge, because I was like, mmm, right, right. It was this per Persona 4 for you guys that that know everything about it. I was so lost. I was like, okay. Right, right, she does this. Mm -hmm. Just go in there, know your anime, know it to the to the T, cause uh these people they go hard and they they don't wanna go home. Yeah. <laughs> I I had no idea. And to let you guys know Oh Oh yeah, I forgot about this. My bad. Here's Sexy the Cat. <laughs> and here he is. Or, if you want, she. <laughs> Has no gender. No gender. It's just a cat. A cat that is whatever you want it to be. But, yep. I guess that's all I've had to say. I don't want to keep rambling, because I can do this all night long. But, uh, wow. Oh. You, the urge to make YouTube videos is um, quite strong. It's currently 1.05 in the morning. And, um, sleep is non-existent in my book, I believe. <laughs> Who needs sleep? It's, it, it's not needed. No, I'm just kidding, guys. Yo, you need your sleep. Well, peace out, guys. And, uh, if you like this, thumbs up. If you don't, it's all good. But, yo, if you do like my content, please subscribe, like up this video, and share it with your friends. Thank you. Bye.